Put well, it. I thought this had a smoke ring for a minute, and I just realised it's all your lipstick. We're in North Carolina. We're at Cookout. Please, can I have a barbecue plate? Cookout style, burger regular. Can I order a hot dog as well? Can I have a chicken strip snack with cookout sauce? And a banana pudding milkshake, please, ma'am. $23.48. That seems quite cheap, that really. That seems really cheap. Alana's got pen all over her face. So we've got the chicken strips to start with the cookout sauce. Okay, ma'am. You went for oh. the biggest one. Oh, that's okay, Daddy. Okay. Yep. Try it without the sauce first. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Nice coating. Completely different from Bojangles. Completely different. Not quite as good, if you ask me. A little bit dry. I was about to say that, just a little bit. I mean, it's still really tasty. What sauce is this? This is the cookout sauce. I have no idea what that tastes like. Cookout special sauce. I'm going to try some. Mm. I was mm. half expecting it to be like Chick-fil-A sauce, but it's not. Hot. Mm. It's hot. Like too hot. Do you want a bit of this one? Yeah, yeah a little bit dry. Hot well. Not like really dry, but just a little bit. You have to excuse Alana's face. We just had a Patreon meetup <coughs> and Alana was giving some felt tips and when we went looking she decided to play with the pens in the car and subsequently draw on her face. It's not bad. Mm. I like the coating. Mm-hmm. It's not like too round with flavour. The chicken is just a little bit dry. Just a little bit. Mm. No, I did eat all of mine, so it can't have been that bad. <laughs> okay, Miss Leach, what we got next? Ooh! So this next plate, we've got barbecue. Now, in North Carolina, when you have barbecue or order barbecue, you just get pulled pork. First, we were like, well, what barbecue? What do you choose? But it is just pulled pork. Mm -hmm. Okay, barbecue. Ooh. I can smell the smoke. Okay. That's it. Mm. It's different from what I was expecting, to be honest. Is there like tomato or tomato in there? I have no idea, but I quite like it. Definitely not dry. Ah, there's mustard seeds in mm. there, and maybe it is tomato or tomato. There's a bit of a zing to that, isn't there? Maybe a bit of vinegar. Oh. I'm going to try a fry. Oh, the cookout fries. Fry, please. You want a fry? Yeah. Yes, please. Right, I'll, I'll let some cool down for you then, baby. What do you think of these fries? Yeah, okay. They're a little bit soggier than some mm. fries, and literally we are sat here eating it, fresh from order in the parking lot, so it's not like we've gone anywhere, but I think that's their style. Okay. Oh, we've got slaw here. Oh. Okay, so white slaw, I think this is. White slaw. Try this. Hmm. It's quite a neutral flavour to it, so certainly something to clean the palate. Cleanse the palate. Hmm. Still's not bad, actually. Yeah. I'm quite enjoying this for the price. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, these are the hush puppies. <gasps> oh, we've got to try a hush puppy. Oh, yeah. Right, hush puppy. <laughs> Slush. Hush puppy. Not slush puppy. Uh. <laughs> Mm. I was expecting these to be sweet. No. That says more savoury. Let's try it. Mm. Nice. Oh. Don't give me. Mm. Nice. Oh. Mm. So is that like corn inside? Mm -mm. Tastes nice. I actually like those. Mm, I do. I'm not too sure what to make of the pulled pork. I'm not too sure. It's not dry. It's got a bit of vinegar in it, I think. I like it, but did you prefer the chicken tenders? Yeah. Okay. Well, we have got some other things to try. Mm. We've tried to do a little bit of everything. Now, one thing that I think you will like is this one, the hot dog. Hot dog. Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. I love me a hot dog. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. So I went for mustard and tomato ketchup. Oh, I think I smoked as well. Oh, really? Not expecting that. Mm. 
Ooh, smells nice. That is actually good. Mm. That might be my favorite so far. Mm. 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 You're like your daddy, aren't you? So what do you give that then? Chew it. Chew it. <laughs> Chew. Uh, I quite like that. I like that. Mustard and tomato ketchup, or just ketchup. As a twist, really, really nice. We still got a burger and we still have the banana pudding milkshake. Just before we get into the burger, we are a, a British family obsessed with the US. We love American food. The channel is all about our little family trying different American cuisines. And then when we're not in America and we're back home, we are trying to replicate them, be it in our kitchen or on our offset Franklin hit smoke. If that sounds good to you, subscribe. Join our family. We would really, really appreciate it. All three of us. We bloody love you. Now let's get back on with a burger. Oh, burger. Let's know in the comments below if you've been to cook. Before. And I need more hot dog. Yes, and what your? Oh, you want some more hot dog? No more. You're just. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Let us know in the comments down below if you've been to cookout before. We'd like to hear from you and what your go-to order is. As for burgers. No. Oh. It does look like a proper burger that you'd cook at home, I think. So I just went for this cookout style, as you know. So let's try. Oh, it's got chili on it. Ooh. That does look good. Alana's just gone off with the hot dog. Don't eat all of it, because Daddy wants some. <laughs> no, no, you have it, baby. Good? It is. I'm going to let you say something before I give my verdict on it. Well, I thought this had a smoke ring for a minute, and I just realised it's all your lipstick. Oops. <laughs> okay, I can eat a bit more. Oh, Daddy probably wants to try a bit more hot dog. That's all right. See, I was going to say, mm. it's the onion that's got the flavour. The burger hasn't got that much flavour, if you ask me. Well, I think the lipstick takes over the most of the, the flavour. Hey, there's no flavour on the lipstick, just colour, <laughs> all right? <laughs> Elena, do you want to try some burger? I don't know what you're saying. Maybe a bit of tomato ketchup or tomato ketchup. Ah. Mm. 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 It's nice. But above that, it's not really got much flavour, so I'm a little bit disappointed with that one, if I'm going to be truthfully honest. No, no, I think it's OK. Not the tastiest. No. But maybe a bit of tomato ketchup. Yeah, but it's got chilli and it's got onions and it's got mustard. It should have a bit more flavour mm. than that, in my opinion. Well, I'm hoping the redemption is in this banana pudding milkshake. Now, I know Cookout has got over 40 milkshakes, and when we looked at the menu, there was a lot of choice. I couldn't decide, but we had that banana milkshake in Checkers. Mm. If you haven't watched that video, make sure you check that one out. So we thought got to do banana pudding milkshake i know that there's someone in the back of this car and when the milkshake comes out she's gonna come running she's like a bloodhound she's gonna sniff it out won't she Mommy, i see my card here we go it's not coming out it's not coming, coming out. out well that means it's really thick i think not working not working it's not working well if you want a thick milkshake and get a cookout Oh no, lips. Did you get some? Let mummy try and see if I can pour some up. Okay, that tastes like fresh bananas, isn't it? Is it? Try it. Okay. It does take a lot. We might. Oh wow, it's thick. Daddy, it's yes. very thick, darling. Daddy, see you in a minute. Yeah, it's very thick. I'm Daddy, struggling to get Daddy, it out. Daddy, thank you, Dad. Yeah, that's ridiculously uh, thick. It's really thick, darling. Is it coming out? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's very thick. Uh -huh. Try there. Got some? You got some? Oh, I got some You want some more? Mmm, mmm. Yeah. Mmm, you try that now, Dada. That's nice. Now, I'm just wondering why you're doing that. Maybe the burger needs a dip in the cookout sauce, maybe. It shouldn't need one, but... Do you know what? Because it's banana pudding, it's also got bits of wafer in it, so I think that makes it even a bit more difficult to oh, suck up through the straw. This might be one of those that you have to eat with a spoon. But it's very hard to get out. Very hard to get out. I'm going to try and get this. I'm probably not going to do anything, but... It's better with the sauce. 
But as we know with barbecue, if it's good, you don't need sauce. I'm really glad we tried it. I'm glad we tried it, yeah. It was good. Not the best sort of takeaway we've ever had, but certainly by no stretch of imagination is it bad. It's good. I'd probably say it's a seven. Seven out of ten for me overall. I think it's probably a five. It's middle of the range. I was a bit disappointed because oh. I was excited to cook out because it's a North Carolina thing and I thought it was going to blow my mind and unfortunately it didn't the banana pudding milkshake is good though and the hush puppies are good but yeah it's just middle of the line for me i really enjoyed the banana pudding but again for me seven out of ten we will be doing a video on some of our takes on meeting cowboy kent aaron franklin etc if you want to see that don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell all that leaves this little british family to say is take care bye bye see you next video yeah Take care. God bless. Bye -bye. See you next video.